Hey everybody, welcome back to Mark Reacts. Today, I'm doing something kind of different. I'm going back to my past. I'm gonna react to a trailer of a game that I've been playing most of my entire childhood, and that's Scooby-Doo Mystery Mayhem. Now, what's really funny about this one is that this was a promo trailer. The only one I could find is a VHS capture, so the quality that you see isn't that good. I do apologize. I don't remember seeing a trailer for this game, so I'm having a look now to see what was the trailer like was it even good why wasn't on tv i'm guessing as by promo i'm guessing it was on the vhs tapes or just on um, some dvd bonuses clearly remember that i never saw this on tv at all so let's begin scooby-doo and the gang are back i love this play is either shaggy or scooby it has some good soundtracks as well i do know that to sneak past oh, the scientist level was the hardest for me. Rated E for everyone. <laughs> that was a quick one, but uh, you know, about 30 seconds long. I liked at the end it said what platforms it was on. I owned it for all four of them. It came out on PlayStation 2, GameCube, Xbox and Game Boy Advance. The Game Boy Advance one I didn't like that much because as it was a Game Boy it was only like limited to what it can do so it was a side scrolling game. At the same time it, that, that's all we got and some people who couldn't afford the console ones that's what they grew up playing and I don't mind that okay it, it was still a game but it just got really boring for me because I like playing the consoles one where you have more environment to move around in. The first one I owned it on was the PlayStation 2, but then I gradually got it for the Xbox original. I don't know how we got the original, I can't even remember. I know I re-brought it like two years ago, just to play some of the old game. I think it was my brother who actually owned the Xbox original. And then GameCube, again, was probably my brother as well. I think I played it when he wasn't even here, so. That was pretty good. I played it when he was outside playing football or something. Just looking at the promo, I saw this shows some clips, which was quite good. But um, the disguises, I remember the laboratory one. That was the hardest one because it's all about sneaking around. You have to use stealth. And that was like the first game where I was actually doing stealth. Because when I play games that you require you to do stealth, but you can go loud, I go loud because I don't bother with stealth. The game was pretty good. And lots of people always say that First Frights is their favourite one. To me, it has to be mystery mayhem it just has to be because the way it was like shaggy and scooby find the book mind you they're terrified of anything like spooky and they had to suck the ghosts the real demons and ghosts into the book and when i was actually playing it it reminded me of 13 ghosts of scooby-doo where they had to capture the ghosts and put them back in the chest that one they released them so they had to return with this one they got no choice they just had to because they found the real book sometimes down the line do a review of the game like do a 10 minute review summarize it and all that and i'll go in more depth but yeah this is another a reacting video i hope you guys enjoyed this one if you did please leave a like and if you're new to the channel then please subscribe and when you do subscribe make sure you tick that bell to keep up to date when I post new and exciting videos every Monday to Friday at 10 a.m. and um react videos I try and put up on a Saturday because the Monday to Friday slot I normally reserve for unboxing videos but if I have no unboxing video for that day then I would put a react video on one of them days but it's mostly on a Saturday I would normally do reacting videos so anyway guys you have a nice day and take care